Hello everyone, I'm Brooke Bateman from Keg River Chemical and today I'd like to talk about how to test sulfur bentonite products. So the test involves activating the product the same way that, that water activates the product after it's been applied in the field. And if you use a very good bentonite clay that, like the, we use at Keg River Chemical, the result of the, the disintegration process will be a very small particle size distribution. And the literature is very strong on this, saying that uh, the agronomic performance of the product is linked to how small the particle sizes are. And the reason for that is because you have a very high surface area exposure to microbes in the soil, making it easy for the microbes to colonize when it has that soil contact. Here we have a degradability demo between Keg 85S, which is the brown one, and a competitor sample that I got just recently. So we measured out 20 grams of each sample, and then we add 10 cc's of water to each. And then you have to try to get them all wet if possible. And then you let the product just uh, degrade for 24 hours. Let the water fully activate the clay in the product, just like so. So then after 24 hours, the samples are both fully degraded and dried. And then the next stage is to run them through the 60 mesh screen and the 80 mesh screen in order to separate the size fractions. After going through the screens, this is what you see. In the back part of each tray here, you have the particles which pass 80 mesh, and that represents a particle size of about 180 microns or less. This represents a size which is easily oxidized by thiobacillus into plant available sulfate. So there you have it. This simple test is a great way to tell which products will degrade better in the field. Thank you for watching my presentation. Hope you enjoyed it and please subscribe.